Shadow Snows had a video where he was asking about keyboards, and he wants a video response, and specifically he wants to you know, see your keyboard collection, specifically, you know, what you use to write your comments on YouTube with, and and uh, primarily I actually use this Dell XPS laptop that I've upgraded over the years, and newer processors and things, because it's very uh, convenient to just, you know, take it from room to room, and take it outside, and, you know, that's... I like writing on that uh, rather than my desktops. Um, I actually, most watch most of my videos on the television. I'll, I'll, I'll come on to this and I'll say watch later. And I'll go to the TV and watch them. Uh, but I'll come back to this to write the comments. And uh, it's, it's a very nice feeling keyboard. Uh, and I've used it quite a lot over the years. And you can see just how, how much I've used it. Here you see my very worn out keyboard. You got the ASD keys are worn off, paint's worn off, E key, paint's worn off, space bar, it's got a little spot there where you use it. C's coming off a little, M's coming off, greater than, uh, down, down arrow. It's just, uh, you see, I've used it. A lot over the years. I'm missing. This is actually. Um, I don't know what. What does that use? I think that's a, a menu button or something. But I actually took it off because the spring on my my Y key wasn't working anymore. It broke. So I actually I took this one apart, sacrificed sacrificed the metal piece in it, and put it into the Y key so I can still use the Y key. Or I could just buy a new keyboard for five dollars. I don't know. <laughs> At the time, I didn't. At the time, I was like, "Oh, whatever. I don't care right now." <laughs> Until it breaks another key, and then I'll probably have to buy another one. But yeah, I mean, it's very, very nice action, and I. You know, I have no problems. I know where all the keys are. It's you know, it's not. It's, it took took a little getting used to, but you know, it's actually. For uh, it's for a laptop. This is the best keyboard I've ever had on a laptop. Uh, it it actually feels quite nice. I also use these uh, other keyboards from time to time. Uh, this one in particular, this is a Dell. I don't know what the model is, but it feels nice. It's, you know, none of these are mechanical, but they feel nice. They do the job good. This is the one for my DOS computer. It doesn't actually uh, do too much YouTube commenting. Uh, it is connected to the internet, but can't really handle YouTube anymore, unfortunately. So it's you know, pretty much this one, and you know, I do use this one on occasion. Yeah, it's not too bad of a keyboard, but I do use it. And while I don't uh, write YouTube comments on it, nothing, absolutely nothing, will ever be a better keyboard than this one. This is my favorite keyboard of all time, the Amiga 500 keyboard. This one is mechanical. It feels perfect. I learned how to type on this computer, and I absolutely love it to death. Nothing, nothing feels better than that keyboard. I can type stories, and I still do. Like I'll type, I'll type stories or whatever, and then I'll transfer them to the computer. And uh, because this is, I've never written it as good on anything as this one. I wrote, I wrote so good on this keyboard. I went to a class in school to take typing class or whatever and uh, they, they gave a test to everybody just to see if how good your skills were. My skills were good enough that they said you don't need to take the class. <laughs> and it was all learned on this beautiful machine. And again, while not a uh, YouTube commenting uh, keyboard, uh, this, is, uh, this is the VIC-20 and it's the same on the Commodore 64 too. Um, there's this keyboard. I actually, you know, besides the iconic look, I have never, ever to this day learned how to write good on this keyboard. It's just a clumsy keyboard. It is mechanical, but it is, it's very hard to learn how to write good on this keyboard and the lack of certain keys and, you know, tab and, you know, nothing is where it's supposed to be on this keyboard. There's no up and down arrows, you gotta hit shift and things, and it's just, this is, 
the worst keyboard I've ever used, probably. And it's just, it just takes, it's, it's such a pain to use this keyboard to write anything. I still, to this day, mess up load commands and things sometimes. And if you mess up a load command, you accidentally hit something, you go to the top, and then you have to uh, make it go down and to the right and things. It's just, ah, oh, such a pain. But it is iconic, and I don't actually anyway. uh, show me. Uh, I'm actually gonna show you. Uh, I'm actually gonna comment on the Shadows Nose video right here, and uh, this is gonna be my comment that I'm gonna post for this video, and letting him know that I did it. So, uh, so you can see it in action. Hey. Enjoyed the video. Made a video response for you. It's, that was a. This was an interesting, uh, interesting uh, question because I never would have thought to ask uh, about anyone's keyboards. You are right, however. It is the most important uh, part in communicating with the community. Well, I'd first like to give a shout out and thanks to uh, the Shadow Snows who uh, made the keyboard video and asked for video responses. Um, yeah. Oh, him a lot. He is the, uh, my first, my first, and pretty much my only real subscriber. He's the only one that has interacted really thus far. So, and so the chances of if you're seeing this, you've probably already seen his video. But just in case, go check out his video on the left there, the original. Show me your keyboard video. On the top, top there, we'll have my uh, new newest video, which may or may not be available when you see this. It's my collection video. I go into all my uh, systems. From the uh, VIC-20, Commodore 64, Amiga, to my consoles, NES, and everything. And uh, open up some of them, and show you my joysticks and peripherals and things. And hope you guys will check that out whenever it's available. And on the uh, right there, I have my uh, gameplay video of Carly and the Spider on the VIC-20. Uh, my newest video. I hope you guys will check that one out. Uh, proud of that one, and I hope you guys subscribe if you uh, want to see more. I appreciate it. Alright.